Alright, so, the one goddamn time Nintendo decides to have a Nintendo Directs, I have a therapy appointment, and I miss it. So, don't worry guys, I've cancelled all future therapy sessions. This, this is clearly more important. Um, so, one thing I'm looking forward to is if there is either no Zelda... Or no uh, NAC 2 port, or maybe even a NAC 3, then I will piss my pants. If there is either uh, Zelda or NAC 3, I will shit my pants. It's, I promise you. All right, let's 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 start this. I'm not expecting much. I don't think we're gonna get much, honestly. I'm I'm kind of pessimistic when it comes to these things. I just I'm not I'm not too sure. COVID-19 release dates and other information present this video or subject to change. Oh god, that's loud. That's fine. <gasps> oh, it's the Pikman. Oh, I want to see... I'm happy. I'm happy. This kind of gives me Kirby and the Forgotten Land trailer vibes. Something about overgrown vegetation taking over an abandoned earth. Just kind of, I'm going to be honest, it gets my knocker off. Like, it, it <laughs> Nature re finally healing itself in the absence of humans. That aesthetic, it, it makes me hard. That bitch is an Olimar! Oh, that Whoa, that looks really- that looks- That almost looks like too good. For Switch. The- dude, the lighting. Look at the lighting- I mean... Yeah, the lighting on this thing is killer. Obviously, I don't know about resolution or, like, frame rate, but the lighting itself and the- Ooh, you can climb it now. Collect treasure. Ice Pikmin. Can you, like, throw them on water, maybe? That'd be cool. Oh, you can freeze enemies. Throw them on water, create platforms? I fucking called it. They give you a doggy? A doggy, Nintendo? Who the fuck was Shepard? He can swim? Wait, what the fuck is the point of Pikmin? This dog is just... He found a castaway. I don't know what that's supposed to mean. But what's the point of Pikmin if the dog can just do all of the, like, obstacles that different Pikmin used to solve? Oh, you can, like, lock them on. With the gyroscope of, um, the Switch. This... This might fuck. God, I, I, I love Pikmin, man. Release it! Or time window. Nope, okay, that's fine. Unless they're gonna give it to us now. Oh. Oh shit. Oh! Three days after my birthday, I will share the week with Pikmin 4. And honestly, I'm. I, you can rename my birthday to Pikmin 4 day, and I'd be fine with it. Oh, that's creepy. Because, like, in the old ones, they obviously have the nighttime mechanic, but... Thank hi, Shinya Takahashi. That was the latest trailer for Pikmin 4. A dog-like creature was spotted. What kinds of things will it show us? Please look forward to more yeah, but, like, breaking all that, carrying the enemy, 
Yeah. Swimming. There was all things you were supposed to do with different types of Pikmin. So I wonder how, what new obstacles. This new hero is a real gem. Ishi. Introducing volume three of the Xenoblade Chronicle <laughs> 3 expansion pass DLC. Straight back. Back to this is the This is the Nintendo Direct that I know and love. The newest hero and a refined lapidarist. This is what this is what Nintendo Directs are for. Bullshit RPGs that like twelve people will be really excited for. Select only one character and battle wave after wave of enemies. For every win, you learn more yeah, Pikmin 4 in July. Honestly, I mean, that makes sense as a big-time summer release. Although I'm afraid... I guess Zelda has to be the... The, like, November. November, December release, right? Tell me why! Is this really what you want? Nothing's gonna get through to him! He's a heartless machine! No, I'm not... Hey, it's the stage from Smash that Brothers. Wasn't enough for you. Volume 3 of the Xenoblade Chronicles 3 Expansion Pass for the Xenoblade Chronicles 3 game launches on the Nintendo Switch system February 15th. You couldn't bump it up seven days to be like a cool, here's a new thing. Is this a rhythm game? Oh, it's Someday Amigo. I know this. This is actually cool. Controllers and gently shake them like maracas to match the targets during a song. Oh damn, that's fun. Follow the instructions on screen to pose. Looks like a goddamn acid dance. trip, but it looks fun. But the unexpected might happen, so stay on your toes. Why not dance with a friend to predict your compatibility in Love Checker? <laughs> Make sure to show up Gavin, I know you're fucking watching this. That's gonna be me and you. Compete online in World Party. Those with the lowest scores in each round will be eliminated. Keep the beat and aim for first place. Forty songs are included, spanning a multitude of genres from around the world. So grab those controllers and get shaken when Samba de Amigo Party Central shimmies onto Nintendo Switch this I didn't realize that was Sega. Sega developed game. Oh, this looks rough. Hold up, no. Go back. Hold up. Welcome to... What the fuck is this, Nintendo? What the fuck is this nightmare? Ma Did you forget to add textures to her face? Passion for fashion. Is that what Japanese people think Welcome Africans look like? Dreamer. This is, the place is that their to concept? And express yourself. Here, you'll aim to become a stylish influencer, and you're in luck. Tons of people are seeking the latest trends. Give them a like if you dig their style. Or a, suggest new outfits for them to grow as an influencer. Or a game about looking your best. This really does look like garbage. Now it's time for fashion design. Ah, oh, hell yeah. Choose from over 1,000 design options. Then add a personal touch to give your item a final flourish. You can get the items other people are wearing by liking them. Mix and match your favorites to so just like everybody's ones. stuff. Why would you ever not By like someone's online, you can whatever? Your friend circle and grow your brand. Got an eye for fashion? Then get Obviously. Stylish. When Fashion Dreamer debuts Come on, this is on Nintendo Switch this is Nintendo this fans year. you're talking about. Oh, we got great fashion. Into these dark worlds. Spooky. Castle oh. In this new paid DLC oh. Roguelite action platformer, Dead Cells. Oh. Venture through the castle's hellish halls. Dead Cells getting DLC. That's we. Oh, it's exclusive. I is it exclusive? Nintendo stuff. I don't know. And other iconic weapons as you vanquish legions of monsters and frenetic. That's cool. That's cool. Original covers and 51 songs from the Castlevania series See, this is the shit I love 
that Nintendo does better than like any other company is incorporating indies into and combining them with their franchises. Enter a new grid in this narrative puzzle adventure set within the Tron universe. Uncover dangerous truths and retrieve what was lost as you navigate through a perilous world. Your decisions and the alliances you forge will impact your journey and the entire server. Tron Identity launches first for consoles on Nintendo Switch this April. Who's there? Wait, is that? Well, that can't be good. What the fuck? The bending murder mystery Ghost Trick returns in HD. I know nothing about this. And becoming a ghost, you can possess and control objects. It looks interesting. With your powers, you can even help others like this woman and change any ill-fated uh fates. Is it the same scene every time? Nintendo Switch this summer. I'm assuming not. Two connected worlds, one suspenseful thriller. Oh, I was expecting this to be a bullshit RPG. But instead, this looks like a badass RPG. Is that Bead from the 8th gen Pokemon games? I feel like I recognize that specific Japanese voice. Not that one. But this this guy, I guess the main character. Oh, that, that motherfucker's played something and something I know. <laughs> oh shit. It's an incel. And a furry. Jewel eater. <laughs> I don't know why that's funny to me, but having an enemy named Jewel Eater. <laughs> Makes me giggle. Watch out, he's gonna eat your jewels. Call the police, the jewel eater is out. Once upon a time, there was a witch and a demon. Experience Bayonetta's origins as a young witch what? named Cereza. Seeking the power to rescue her imprisoned mother. She ventures deep into the Avalon Forest ruled by fairies. I didn't expect this forest. at all. I'm going to become a witch and save mummy. There, she'll encounter the otherworldly demon Cheshire. You'll control both witch and demon at the same time. Harness Cereza's magic and Cheshire's ferocity to travel through this mysterious this and dangerous forest. I'm not, like, the biggest Bayonetta, like, lore specialist, but I'm gonna be honest. This doesn't look like... This doesn't look like Bayonetta. I mean, it looks neat, but... The duo will gain strength as they continue their journey. By obtaining more powers, new paths can be opened, and battles can be more easily swayed in your favor. Can Cereza and Cheshire find their happily ever after? Cheshire, let's go! Bayonetta Origins, Cereza and the Lost Demon prowls onto the Nintendo Switch system March 17th. All right. Pre-orders are available now on Nintendo eShop. That was a, that was a video game. How was that? Weird. Next. Please take a look at this. Completely unnecessary transition, but I appreciate the effort. Ugh. I don't. I don't care. I don't. Is this supposed to mean something? 
spooky. Major poppin'. Major poppin' with that guy. Oh, look, look at the wall. Look at the wall to the left of the girl. Fucking. <laughs> what what does that mean? Introducing the Splatoon 3 expansion pass. This paid DLC includes two waves of content. The first wave is Inkopolis. Make All right. this splat-tastic place from the original. I remember Splatoon this from the first game. Grounds. Wasn't wasn't this a lot to do. Base. It's got some pretty nifty weapons and gear. You might spot a few familiar faces alongside new shopkeepers. Products here are the same as the ones in Splatsville, so shop okay. wherever your vibes are strongest. Wait, it's the same items? Salmon run. Table turf battle, the show, and I... amiibo functionality all work in the same way here too. Maybe I just don't get Splatoon. The Squid Sisters will also perform here during Splatfests. Okay. Need a mix of old school and freshness? Then head over to Inkopolis. Okay. Old school as in seven years ago. DLC launches this spring. Okay. Please don't continue and talk about wave two. Oh, what's this? The fuck? This isn't still Splatoon. Oh, it's the Octo whatevers. This looks way more interesting than the rest of Splatoon 3. It's got a nice ass. Okay. Can you uh, continue? Wave one, oh my wave god, are we still going over this? this spring. Wave two, side order will launch in the future. Cool. Bum, 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 bum. The Splatoon bum, 3 bum, bum, bum. Packs will be available later today on Nintendo eShop. I'm this that splatoon made me tired and it was only like two minutes. Thank you all very much. Yep. We hope players will be able to enjoy the game even more with the upcoming paid expansion pass. Yep. Please look forward to more information about Splatoon 3 in the future. Let's see some more Nintendo Switch headlines. Adventure awaits Mickey oh. and friends on Illusion Island. It's not often you get a Mickey Mouse, new Minnie Mouse, Mickey Donald game, Duck, and every now and then they're and really good. Be. Embark on a new adventure to find I like the art style. Magical books and save the mysterious island of Monarch. So I guess Run, this is jump, the new Kingdom Hearts looks swim. weird to as hell. Every nook and cranny of the island. <laughs> looks better than the third one. By unlocking special abilities, you can reach new places and find this secret looks areas. cute. Cross large chasms with boost jump. Round pound barriers to open new spaces. And glide through the air to reach distant platforms. I did this areas. is each character's but personality. Aesthetically actions. Up to four this looks bitchin'. Brave the island. Share a hug for extra help. Multiplayer, that's cool. Play leapfrog for larger jumps. That's or cool. Drop a rope to lend a hand. That's also cool. Work together to save now the multiplayer actually new plays different, you know. While exploring the island, you'll meet unusual allies and dangerous foes. Study their movements carefully to figure out the secrets to victory. Join Mickey and friends on a high-flying adventure. You know what? I might. Island. 
swinging onto Nintendo Switch July 20th. If it's above twenty dollars, then no. But <laughs> nice fifteen dollar game. That'd be nice. Emblems are on the way. Emblems, fire emblems are coming to future waves of the Fire Emblem Engage. Why do we need the Hector? The the Dynasty War is this Dynasty War? No, this is Three Houses. I apologize. Is it? Is Three Houses a game that is out? I'm not gonna look that up because I feel like if it is, then it's like two years old. And I'm gonna look like a dummy. No, this is definitely. This is definitely the. Overwhelm foes with sword and magic attacks. Oh, they're gay as hell for each other. Veronica, emblem of heroes. I see you. Summon additional allies to fight for your cause. Challenge newly added missions to recruit these new emblems. Cool guy. Four, a new story called Belzinalog will be unlocked. I forget how fucking boring Nintendo Directs are sometimes. Wave 2 of the Fire Emblem Engage expansion pass for the Fire Emblem Engage game launches on the Nintendo Switch system later today. Okay. Come on, what's next? Take control. Oh, this looks like a neat little, neat little game. A world in which deities known as Oh wow, it's like Avatar. But weird. I don't like her face. The future of humanity hangs in the balance. In this narrative adventure, harness your divine. I feel like the description, the voiceover, doesn't add. <laughs> doesn't really add information. That I couldn't get just from the visuals. If anything, it just kind of makes a lot of these secondary mystery games seem like the same. Because they do a lot of these little narrative-based adventure games in, these, in the directs. And I'm sure playing them are great, but they all kind of just like mesh together in my brain. And I think the voiceover might have something to do with that. These games will have you rolling. Katamari Damacy? That's not Katamari Damacy at all. Just around the corner. After today's Nintendo Direct, I'm sure this will be good. I'm sure it will. Will I actually play it? We are yet to see. Because I also said the first one and Triangle Strategy look good, but I didn't. I didn't play those. Venture through a brand new world. In Octopath Traveler 2, launching on Nintendo Switch, February 24th. Sorry, but if it's not fun. Oh, it is rolling! You mother- Did they, like, accidentally switch around these trailers in the editing timeline? Because I don't think Octopath Traveler has anything to do with rolling. New features include playing as the young king of all cosmos in five new challenges. Huh. This looks like Katamari Damacy. Which can be said about all the Katamari Damacy games, but... Oh, did that just, like, lag? Did that just, like, lag like crazy? Damacy reroll. Also not... doesn't look like a rolling-based game. I think... Meet characters from all uh, walks of life. Oh, it's a roll because it's with time to tap. Oh, compliment your because this and Octopath for role playing games. Yasunori Mitsuda, a guest oh, my God. Sea of stars. Oh, that makes so, so much Switch more sense. Oh, I was so <laughs> confused. Because I was like, they're not rolling in this game. This is rolling. <laughs> Holy shit. I might be the... I, I'm not sure if I'm the dumbest man on the planet, or if that Nintendo advertising company, or advertising division just, like, needs a boost in, in, a, in its budget, because that would... 
Oh, that was like a uh, that was like a one-two punch to my gut. Like I went through a lot of emotions then. That's that's just that's that was just hentai. We all agreed that they just showed hentai. That the the fucking cat lady. <laughs> Look at this walking cycle. Look at that walking cycle. Ah, that's a walking cycle. Oh, this is a. This is like an. Oh, it's an interesting way to. By drawing the map as you explore, you can progress even further. You have to draw the map. That's so unique. The labyrinth with five That's so cool. Because usually you just roles, walk in an area that you haven't been, and the like cloud of fog on the whatever just disappears, and it's like earthbound in the combat. This game might be badass. Might be badass. This is like a bunch of things that like, aren't really done in most games, and I'm kind of digging them all being combined. I- the whole- the one thing you were selling me on was the not having the auto map function. Each game in the collection will also be available separately on Nintendo Oh, this is like a series? Pre-orders begin today. I did Nintendo not know that. I did not know that. I might have to check out the first one. Get your tactical it's finally out, baby. Calling all strategy fans. The <laughs> they delayed this because it was a bad look during the Russian-Ukraine war. But I guess they've just, they've just given up. <laughs> they, they just, they don't care about the war anymore. Finally, we're getting this game. April 21st, that's, that's, that's good. It's been a good direct, I mean, Pikmin 4... And Advanced Wars and Octopath 2. Kirby. Kirby. A new story will unfold in the Kirby's Return to Dreamland Deluxe game. You're adding DLC to a port of a like 15-year-old Wii game. Is that what we're doing now? Is this a thing? Have we decided? Or maybe this is a three the three DS game. No, 3DS was triple trouble. Or triple deluxe. This is... is a basic attack and jump. Oh, so to the game's worse. Powers, you'll need to collect magic points by defeating enemies. With magic points, different abilities can be restored and enhanced. Cool, I guess. But like, also, why? Or Who was? This is one of those like really weird Nintendo things, you. you know? There are over 20 interdimensional stages to explore. And like this port isn't that isn't like brand new. Up to four I think this port might be like a year old. Through this mysterious realm together. Can Magalore restore his powers and safely return to his world? I think Nintendo just has a rule that if they don't do something Kirby related once every four months, like the entire fucking like headquarters will just blow up. After today's Nintendo Direct, a demo will be available on Nintendo eShop. Do you need a do you need a demo? Players can play a specially arranged demo with select stages and sub games. Do you need a demo return for Kirby? Return Return to Dreamland. This my oh oh I, I guess the port hasn't come out, but still this is weird. We hope you're looking forward to the because you know they're gonna charge like Kirby's forty bucks for that. Next, here's some news about Nintendo Switch Online. Please take a look at this. Oh, it's gonna be fucking Game Boy. I can't wait to play all five good original Game Boy games. Game Boy I have that. I have. On Nintendo 
Switch, you can play these games anytime, anywhere, just like you could back in the day. Let's I have that Mario. That available at launch. Tetris. Arrange the falling tetraminos and I can finally play in school. English because my copy is in Super Mario Land 2 sits golden coins. Right here, I got that. The castle Great game. Stole from you. The Legend of Zelda Link's Awakening mm -hmm. DX. Awaken the Windfish to escape Covalent Island. Not having Pokemon on this thing would kind of be a killer. Gargoyle's Quest. Save the Ghoul Realm as Firebrand from the Ghosts and Goblin series. Game Never heard of it. Gallery 3, play an assortment of Game & Watch titles. Love how there's no music for that part. It's just, we will also have Game & Watch. The new nightmare. Solve a murder mystery on the supernatural Shadow Island. Metroid 2, Return of Samus. Oh. Destroy the Metroids hiding on planet SR388. Now that's cool. Having Metroid 1, 2, and the new Metroids on the same, and Super Metroid. Then you would just need Mario Land's also a great series. Then you would just need what Super Metroid to com to have all Metroid games on Switch. Again, can't get, Kirby has to be involved in something. You can use the Game Boy, Game Boy Pocket, or Game Boy Color screen filters. Up to two players can play compatible games together locally or online. More games will be added in the future. They're gonna add the trading card game, but not the actual... Okay, here it is, right? Oh! I thought they were hard to port, Nintendo. Maybe that's why it's taken five years to get GBA games on this, on this stupid console. Super Mario Brothers 3. Play 38 extra levels okay. on the Nintendo e-reader accessory. Okay. Wear Inc. Mega Micro Games. That's all you need. Experience all you need. Origins of the all you need. Micro games. All you need. Kudu, kudu, kudu I know this game. This is a cute game. Obstacles. It's like that one like Flash Mario game, World Cars Super game. Circuit. Super Circuit, Rich fun game. Mario Kart game created for a portable system. Mario and Luigi Superstar Saga. Venture through a zany world and fight with equally zany attacks. Well, I guess I can just fucking throw away my re my retro console that Zelda, plays Game Minish Boy Cat. games on the TV and, and NES and SNES games. I guess I, I guess that was just a waste Local of money. Play is supported for compatible Stupid games. fucking Nintendo giving me convenience. More games will Metroid Fear. Oh, Fire there we go. Well. Fire Emblem, Go Golden Sun. Now oh, that's a After goddamn this game. You can play these Game Boy titles with the Nintendo Switch Online membership, or play both Game Boy and Game Boy Advance titles with the Nintendo Switch you Online could, expansion you, pack membership. You can throw the GBA into the regular pack. Select Game Boy titles. Will be playable on Nintendo Switch. Mm -hmm. And after today's Nintendo Direct, you'll be able to play the Game Boy and Game Boy Advance titles we introduced. That's cool. Later today, so I can update my Please Switch right now. To more information about and play Nintendo a bunch Switch of games that are objectively kind of shitty. Ooh, Donkey Kong 94. Let's see a few more headlines. Uh, that would be a good one. The original Cause I don't think that game's gotten... Oh, shit! Switch. What? I've had Metroid Prime for like two years. I have yet to play this game. Every time I think I'm gonna get around to it, a new shiny thing comes out and I have to play that. Shit, I'm gonna have to actually play Metroid Prime one of these days. Fuck. I usually just use my GameCube for Sonic Adventure 2 and only that. And maybe Mario Party 4. <laughs> this is big. This is like... This is a fucking, this is a good announcement. People have, and like, these games look good remastered. I wonder how much 
remastering they're going to do. The first Metroid Prime game originally Only the first one, never mind. System has been remastered for Nintendo Switch. And this is still going to cost Explore like 50 bucks. From the perspective of Samus Aran. But beware, there's more to this alien planet than meets the eye. Like, you can swap out that... You can swap out that little bit of description with any Metroid game. They could have done that for uh, for Metroid 2 during the Game Boy thing. Hell, they might re reuse this audio in four years when they have another... When they have to announce that Metroid Prime 4 has been delayed again. This remaster adds new dual stick controls, allowing you to move around. That alone point of view. makes this also select a control makes it worth it. Because that's been one of the things I've been Among fearing with the GameCube version. Explore Talon 4 with your preferred playstyle. Okay, that's cool. I like it when they let you play. They'll offer the updated version, but they'll keep the OG version. Digital version later today, that's interesting. Maybe I don't have to play the GameCube game, I can just buy it digitally and I'll be fine because I already have the box. And Nintendo really wants me to play fucking haunting Metroid Prime, will solve and I've just refused to do it for two and a half years. Ward, a city ruthlessly controlled by Amaterasu Corporation. You'll investigate these incidents alongside master detectives of the organization. Each one has a supernatural ability that can prove useful during investigations. Mimic body types and voices. I don't care. After you drop the. The Game Boy and then the Metroid. You can't follow it up with this. Even if this is a good game, which I'm sure it is, it's like you can't. You gotta throw this into the headlines at the beginning of the show. Use them to get closer to cracking a case. After collecting enough evidence, a mystery labyrinth will appear. I'm gonna shit my pants for real. I know there's a bit at the beginning, but I'm actually gonna poop myself, so I'm gonna cut here and I'll I'll be back. Dude, I just took a gnarly habunka dunk. Anyway, what's his anime shit? Dude, I was actually about to like, shit my pants. Like I sharted like three minutes earlier and I was trying to like shift in my chair to like ignore the wetness of my ass. But like, Wings of the heart, at one point, you know how you're trying to hold it back, held it back. But like, it was it was fighting. Originally released on the Nintendo GameCube system. <sighs> Namco, they make Pac-Man. After a long and peaceful era on the floating islands above Earth, the Empire's conspiracy looms closer. Oh shit, it's Nazis. The spirits dwelling within the protagonists. This looks like a GameCube game. Two different eras of war. And not in like a good way. <laughs> During your travels, mm, actually no, I'm being too I'm being too hard. Too this looks like a PS2 game. Allies. Battles are fought using cards called Magnus. Maybe 3DS. Your attack power is determined by the attributes and combinations of your cards, which are randomly dealt from the deck. In these real-time battles, you'll need to make split-second decisions to edge closer to victory. What revelations will come to light in the skies above and the land? When you put this after Metroid and like Pikmin, it's hard. <laughs> like they need to release two Nintendo Directs, one with the big boys, and then just fucking just have the reels as a completely different direct. Oh. Life game. Life game game. <laughs> While exploring the once thriving island. The close the captioning is really girl. bad with this one. Then travel between past and present to make the island your own. Become Chrono a Trigger angler. meets and this is Animal Crossing. Blacksmith. 
Actually, this might be better than Animal Crossing. Oh yeah, I know, because it looks like you actually, like, do shit. In this one. It's like an actual video game. I mean, sure, they kind of look like my sims. Getting off, giving off major my sims vibes. The restoration is about to begin. Fantasy Life I, the girl who steals time. Girl, the girl who steals time would be a fucking killer 2000s pop punk song. Could you imagine My Chemical Romance or Panic at the Disco doing that one? Or it could go the cheesy uplifting route. By the way, that, there's the detective guy. Or it could go like the cheesy upbeat kind of way. Where it's like, and she's the girl who stole time. With like, I could imagine a Bowling for Soup song being like that. That's it? That was the entire Professor Lane? Okay. Oh. Oh. Yoshi's Island? Oh, it's completely new. That's badass. That's really badass. That's really cool. Hey, that's cool. That's cool. Trans representation and all that. Fucking woke Nintendo. Wave four of the Mario Kart 8 Deluxe Booster Course Pass DLC. Oh, is that it? Game races onto the Nintendo Switch system this spring. Is there? Is that the only? Active Nintendo Switch Online Plus expansion pack members can enjoy this DLC at no additional cost. I think I gotta the get the expansion pass of own. Nintendo Switch Online just for Mario Kart and GBA games. Oh, some of this looks neat. Mega Man Battle Network. Minecraft Legends, this game is... Is this a new game? Oh yeah, no, this is different from the, like, Diablo-style game they tried to do. Blanc, okay. Blanc. Looks cute. Looks cute. We love cute games like this. That's adorable. Fucking just all the Mega Man Battle now. I didn't realize they made that many. They made like, I didn't realize they made like 10 of these. Have a nice death. Well, this is Hollow Knight. That's Hollow Knight. This is a less good Hollow Knight. Probably better than MLB The Show. Disney Dreamlight Valley. I wonder if there's actual, like, if there's an actual game to this, or if it's literally just a big advertisement for Disneyland. Do you just hang out with Simba and Nala? Hail Symphonia Remastered, that's cool. That was really just a bunch of games we didn't give a shit about. This will be our last it better be Knack 3 or, or uh, Zelda. I already shot my pants, so you promised me. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, that's a Zelda. That's a Zelda mountain if I've ever seen one. Ooh, ooh, they got Sky Dragons. I have severe monkey ass right now. Rise, rise, my servants. Oh, sweep over Hyrule. Eliminate oh. this kingdom and her allies. They gave him a voice. No survivors. They gave him a voice. Holy shit. Give me gameplay. I still don't know what this game, like, is at its core. Because, like, that was a place in Breath of the Wild. That was just... Is it... I... I guess it's the same map layout, but they're just filling more shit. Sure. Different shit in it. 
Oh, I don't care. You can just resell me Breath of the Wild. Ooh, that's new. <gasps> you can do fucking rail grinding? Any video game that has rail grinding is automatically 10 out of 10. <laughs> he has a car now, nice. It's like the boat flying thing everybody tried to do. And they knew it wouldn't work, but they still just kept on trying to do it. Tears of the Kingdom. They gotta give us a release date, right? Probably December? November? October? Please, lend him your power. Let me play as Zelda. Whoa! Whoa! My, <laughs> whoa! Are you... Are you... Sh that was The Legend of Zelda, Tears of the Kingdom. We talk in... Entry in The Legend of Zelda series. Oh! In addition to the standard version, a collector's edition of the game oh. various items will release on oh. launch A new amiibo figure of Link from this game will also be available on the same day. I need that expand. I we need that. Looking forward to Link's oh, latest I... grand adventure. I need the, the special deluxe Direct. edition. Fucking Thank goaded Nintendo watching. Direct. Wild. Wild. Making sure I got everything. Yeah, I think that's it. Dude. Okay. Oh, this guy. Fucking saint over here. Leaving the whatever. So let's let's read out what this um this this entails the 2023 of Nintendo. So Tears of the Kingdom, May 12th. Insane. Uh, more Nintendo Switch Online stuff. Uh, Metroid Remaster, which is basically out now. Um, Katamari Damacy is always you know a decent rep. Uh, so a bunch of expansion pass to already like popular games and then you throw in um octopath 2 advanced wars finally coming out uh and pikmin 4 i mean usually systems do not get this level of support like five years in like nintendo's going out with a bang nintendo's going out fucking that's all i'm gonna say God damn.